Just need your help for a sec. Those things don't look steady. They're not. Be careful. Welcome to Avery's neighborhood. It's a nice place. <laughs> if you don't mind some structural problems and some water damage. Yeah, clearly some drainage issues. A <laughs> real fixer-upper opportunity. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so... Looks like somebody blew that dam and then flooded the whole place. You know, I forgot. Pretty good at this. All right, so which one of these do you think is Avery's? Uh, my money's on that one. The one that's still intact. Ah. Oh. They're not so bad at this either. Yeah, well, you know, I've had a little practice. I've read a few books. Shit, no shit! What? What? The front door. It's Sam. He's still alive. And yeah, for now. Come on. All right, keep your eyes open for shoreline types. Yep. Here goes nothing. Whoops! Through here, watch your head. Ooh, someone had it in for this guy. Oh, another old note. Dragon. We're in Christopher Condon's house. <sighs> Shit. Shoreline. Uh. Lena, get down. I see him.
Jesus. I think that's it. You okay? Yeah. Let's push on. <clears throat> Might be a way through this cave. Yeah, it's worth a look. you bring here, Nadine? She does have an entire army. I think they found the truth. Well, let's hope not. For Sam's sake. That's morbid. We can climb up there. Yeah, but it's too high, even for a boost. Then let's look around. <sighs> ah, refreshing. After you. Oh, how sweet. You want me to be your decoy? No. I was being gentlemanly there. <laughs> Just busting your chops. Yeah, well, the chops are plenty busted already. Thank you. Okay? Yeah. I'm fine. You? Well, wet again. Tired, bruised. A little hungry. I could eat. Other than that, fine. <laughs> yeah. Okay, come on. Let's keep going. Come on. Let's try cutting through this house. Yeah. I'm right behind you. Thank you. 
beautiful. Oh, what's this? Jesus. Got all Lord of the Flies in here. No kidding. Nice water feature. Time for another swim, I guess. Hey, Nate. Over there. That looks like an exit. I'll weigh it down for you. Great. Okay. You're welcome. Thank you. you make a great counterweight. Uh, I mean... It's okay. I'll choose to take that as a compliment. Swim <laughs> some water. Missed. Hey, if at first you don't succeed. All right. Let's do that again. Made it. I'll find a way up for you. This should work. All right, stand clear. Here you go. Hey, great. Let's move this out of the way. Yep. Okay. Hey, look. Thomas II's sigil. So we're in his mansion. Second in command. Going up the pirate hierarchy. Good lord. <laughs> Looks like we found the party. Looks like we're a little late. <laughs> hey, Nate. <sighs> Check it out. It's another sigil. Oh my god. What? It's them. Elena, these other pirate captains have founded Libertalia. What the hell happened here? Well, I'm no forensics expert, but I would say... Bad drinks? Apparently. It's 
So what was this? Some kind of wealthy pirate suicide cult? <laughs> yeah, not likely. Not these guys. On behalf of Lord Avery, I invite you to my manor at sundown tomorrow. The time has come to abandon our animosities and reunite under the banner of God and liberty. Signed, Thomas II. What do you bet? Thomas II, Henry Avery. Looks like our hosts didn't stick around to clean up their mess. Well, that wasn't very gracious of them. Okay, so... So these guys sparked a full-scale revolt when they claimed the treasure for themselves. Now, they took care of the colonists, but then they had to deal with each other. And I'm guessing things got pretty messy. So, Avery and Two invite them up here to, um... Uh, what was it? Uh, abandon our animosities. Abandon the animosities. Avery makes a grand toast. For God and liberty! Arg, ahoy, mateys, all that. <laughs> and they all take a swig. Except these two. And just like that, all the treasure of Libertalia becomes the sole possession of two men. These are some of history's greatest pirates, and they all perished in an instant at this very table. It's incredible. Yeah. I'm, I'm sorry. I, uh... I'm sorry. It's okay. So, since our missing hosts aren't here at Two's Manor... We should head over to Avery's. Yeah. Let's go. Up here, slowly. Be careful. I'm okay. I got it. I'll meet you up top. That shoreline truck is still there. Yeah, I see it. Keep your eyes peeled, huh? And we are officially inside Henry Avery's house. <clears throat> Word of the day, ostentatious. So why didn't he kill Thomas too? Was he like his right-hand man? Yeah, that's exactly what he was. <laughs> Can you imagine taking orders from a paranoid psychopath? This sounds like my first job. <laughs> what, the producer on your TV show? No, my manager from Macho Nacho. You worked at a Macho Nacho? It was a high school job. Did you wear one of those hats? The point is, my boss was a paranoid psychopath. He was the manager at a Macho Nacho. Just watch it, okay? Look, Shoreline barricaded the front door. And left a bunch of muddy footprints behind. Let's see where they went.
So, where are all the shoreline guys? I know, right? I expected to see someone by now. Yeah, it's like they all up in Manus. I don't suppose they're pirate and ghosts. <clears throat> Even... Elena, check it out. The footprints go through this door. Block from the other side. Why bother barricading their path unless they found something? All right, help me push this open. Yeah. Oh shit! waiting to ambush us. Yeah. All right, let's get that door open. See what they didn't want us to find. Okay, here we go. You ready? <laughs> oh, hello there. What is it? It's a letter. Signed by... Avery. Really? Read it. <laughs> 